Ever have a stuck optical drive that you can't open to get the disc out? Even without electricity, uh, if you look for that little tiny hole right there, it's a secret release with a paper clip. Stick the paper clip in. Sometimes it takes a little finagling, and that's the secret release. can make a paper clip float. I assure you this is an ungimmicked paper clip and standard tap water. I'd say that's floating. didn't anticipate that it won't go into the middle. There we go. Floating paper clip. Box opener. Or to open your Christmas gifts. Oh, just what I wanted! Of course everyone knows you can eject the SIM card on your cell phone using a paper clip. With a rubber band, you can turn a paper clip into a dangerous projectile. That just pierced some cardboard. You scrape off the plastic insulation with a knife uh, and then bend this into a straight line. You can turn these into excellent antennas for both radio and television. So you've got your antenna situation strained out. Let me show you another good use for a paper clip. What do you do if you misplace one of your jumper straps? Again, you can use a paper clip. These can conduct in an amazing amount of current, even lethal. Uh, so be careful. I was trying to think of an example of electricity I could show that's not going to kill people. Uh, and this would be a good example. You can touch these and there's no way you're going to be harmed. Uh, so this will work as a great wire uh, to conduct electricity once you strip the uh, vinyl insulation off. So you have your jumper straps in place, uh, but what happens if one of them becomes lost or misplaced? So again, comes to the rescue, the paper clip. Problem solved. Here's a trick you can do with a paper clip. Any standard paper clip will do. Just stick it in your hand, wiggle it around until you make this shape, and now you've got a nice little cell phone stand for propping up your cell phone. You can either use it vertically or horizontally. Another interesting feature. I zoom in here. I can even defuse a bomb with a paper clip like this guy shows. So that proves it works. You have two pieces of paper and you want to bind them together. Paper clip.
So these are the paper clips I'm using, also called trombones in French, I guess. They're 28 millimeters. I think I bought these at the Dollar Tree store, if that matters, although I looked at their site and didn't see this exact variety any longer. I bought these many years ago. Anyway, so we've established that this has tons of features. It's 47 survival tools, according to that JRG guy. Uh, it's one of my favorite multi-tools, as is this, a Swiss Army knife made by Victorinox. This happens to be a serrated Spartan, which I recently made a video on because it has an exceptionally sharp knife. If you're into having a very sharp knife, consider this one. You'll see it in the video if you check it out. Anyway, two of my favorite tools, my favorite multi-tools. How can we marry them together? Da da da! You can store the paper clip in the corkscrew. It's almost perfect, like it's made for it. You do have to put it in a very specific way, though, but I'm going to teach you, and it's awfully easy. You undo it just like this, and bingo, you have a fully functional paper clip. So basically, here's how you do it uh, these two loops here, I call this big loop, I call this little loop. Uh, and then this is the opening end. So with the opening end uh, on the top and taking the Swiss Army knife in its open position, attacking it from the top, not from the bottom, attacking it from the top, you just screw it on all the way until it won't go any further. Then back out one rotation such that you want this line to fit in that corner, that deep crevice there. Now you push it downward and inward and you're done. Uh, sometimes it makes a little click sound when you do this. It took me forever to figure out what is that click sound. I'm pretty sure what it is is the little loop is snapping over to the left. Uh, when you do the push down at the very end there you sometimes hear a click and what's happening is little loop is going click over to the left. Uh, not that it matters much, but this is one of the best uh, multi-tool mods I've ever thought of, and it's awfully simple. I love how simple it is. It's completely flush. It doesn't cause any snagging. It looks sexy. <laughs> uh, it's a conversation starter. Uh, it doesn't impede the motion of the corkscrew for actual use uh, once you extract it. You also still have full access to the pin. If you have one of the models of uh, Victorinox that has a pin hole right there and you've loaded it with a pin. So I highly recommend this. Consider this a Christmas gift from me to your sack, your Swiss Army knife. Merry Christmas! Most Swiss Army knives have this tool, it's one of the most common, and there's, that's called a wire bending slot. And indeed, you can bend a wire by sticking it in there. However, it's kind of made for a bigger wire than this one. But here's a trick. If you remove the split ring, you can use this as your wire bender. You can make a very sharp hook on it. Uh, so this makes an excellent wire bending tool specifically for paper clips. And you can even stick that in there even with the uh, split ring inside. Oh, here's yet another trick I learned. You can use this as what's sometimes called a key sergeant. Basically what it does is it keeps your your uh, split ring open uh, while you're trying to insert it on things. You may find that these little baby split rings, they're easy to open up if your fingernails are long enough at least. However, keeping it open far enough at the tip, yet not getting your hand in the way, that sometimes is an issue. 
However, if you stick this in, now you can keep that open and your finger doesn't get in the way. So it becomes much easier to attach it to your device. already attempted this on a previous one, but I'm going to show you how I did it. So after a bunch of pounding and examination, I eventually got it to this state. Another use for these is to extract batteries, especially good if you've cut your fingernails recently. And can you see that little screw down there? Hope this lighting is going to work. So after having bent it, let's see if I can extract this screw. It works. And to reestablish this as a paper clip, you need to put in a rounded object like this and then wrap it back around. Ever have a situation where you only have one single paper clip, but you wish you had two? Just place it in your hand, say abracadabra, and you have two.